Hello guys, this is Coco Robert. So today I have a review for you guys. So I'm going to review my Balenciaga bag. So at this video, I'm going to uh, give you guys a boyfriend review because I re already used this handbag for almost a year so I'm going to give you guys a wear and tear review and how much this bag could fit and like a simple how big is this handbag so let's get started so first of all I'm going to uh, let you guys know how big it is is this handbag this handbag is uh, uh, the color is rose tulian and um, uh, the style is Balenciaga City handbag and the hardware is Dryan hardware as uh, Dryan 12 hardware and this is a rose gold uh, Balenciaga has Balenciaga has so many different like gold color it has silver it has black it has gold color and it has super Dryan hardware and it has normal hardware and I believe the Dryan 21 hardware has been discontinued so now you only can get like normal hardware and this kind of uh, Dryan 12 hardware so give you guys a close up of the hardware and this bed trunk is like my favorite bed trunk I feel like it's really cute to put it on my Balenciaga bag for but for the review purpose, I'm going to take out of my uh, bag trunk because this is not belongs to how Balenciaga bag, so you won't get this uh, when you purchase it. So I actually have an unboxing video for this handbag last year when I got it, and it looks different because now you can see this handbag looks really soft. So not going to out of the topic, I'm going to like. Uh, this is the handbag of uh, this is like CD handbag and it looks really gorgeous with I have uh, so many things inside but I'm going to show you guys later and uh, because this is a drying hardware so you don't have like a tassel hanging out outside it just looks like this and it has uh, a front pocket and of course it has a mirror hanging outside with the matching color. And this is the zipper over here and of course you can put a zipper inside and this is the handle and the handle has like a really famous rope uh, the rope detailing here I really love the details so you guys can see that the drawing hardware is gorgeous and the leather is still shiny uh, really shiny and at the back, it doesn't have any pocket at the, the back. And on the bottom, it doesn't have any like a feet at the bottom as well. It's just really simple and has a really uh, cute mirror. I think the mirror is the the thing that sold on me. And like the later, is so soft, and it has a front pocket here. So the handle is. Let's see how long is the handle. Uh, let me measure it. So I would say it's around four or five inches. Here, from here is around five inches. And if you want to put it on your shoulder, I believe you can do so and it looks okay. It looks okay. Like if you really wanted to carry that as, you can carry that as and super comfortable as well because the handle is uh, not really thin and you can carry it like at your arms. It's really, really chic as well and you can add your mirror hanging outside or not. I normally stick inside so like this and it comes with non-adjustable strap like this and it's, uh, the uh, you can take off the strap. So let me show, so normally I just carry on my shoulder. It looks like this so you were like sag a little bit in the middle that this but it give me more comfortable and I won't be at you won't be able to wear cross body because uh, the strap is kind of short and let me tell you how short and how long is the strap this is the strap and let me measure it the strap is around 19 inches the strap is only 19 inches so it's not super long it's just a simple non adjustable strap but it's really comfortable so and of course you can 
uh, the attack to get here but I just love the way hanging outside when I am carrying it and then I'm going to like measurement it how the width so the width is 15 inches in width like lot 15 inches in width and uh, how let me see the depth it's around five and a half inches in depth and I see high it's 10 inches in height and it's red 10 and it looks like this and now is the I'm going to tell you how much part that this handbag could hold So you can see I carry tons of stuff inside and because of this leather is really thin and soft so it's really lightweight compared to my other uh, Louis Vuitton handbag. So let me show you how much this handbag could fit. Um, let me take out the first item that I got is my <laughs> process clean kit. I have it. I have to have it at every single purse that I carry of course and uh, my cell phones you can stick inside anywhere um my long wallet this is the only rod uh, my long wallet and then my louis vuitton pochette i think this the size is 15 the smaller size and then my little pochette and then of course my sunglasses and my little coin pouch and I still have a room left for more stuff and let, let you guys see the interior and you can see there is a plate here and if you are you have a regular hardware uh, you will have like gold or you have like silver plate but the later plate is for drying hardware and this is like a big pocket inside I got some stuff here and the pocket is pretty large and then you have two small pockets here. One is for your cell phone, one is really tiny, maybe it's for lipstick or something. So when I take out all of the uh, things, you can see that it's really soft, really smooth, and the leather is still shining. I cannot believe I already used this handbag for almost a year. And it looks just like new. And the, um, the most wear and tear part you probably could see is People always say edges, so you can see like a little bit white stuff here, but I think it's okay. It almost looks like new, and the leather still stays really, really shiny. And when I smell it, it still has some kind of leather smell. So I really love this handbag, and look at the bag. I really love the how the leather drops and how the how uh, the later the hardware and the a handle attach on this entire letter so the letter will be hold up like this like pull up i think it's the character of this handbag and i really love it it's really it is not really small but it can hold a lot of stuff you guys just see how much i carry and i still have a room left for my camera or other stuff so i would say i really love this handbag and I, if I'm going to totally recommend you guys if you guys are thinking about getting a Balenciaga bag I would totally recommend you guys to get one because it's just too gorgeous and if you got a regular hardware I believe the handbag will be more lightweight than my uh, giant hardware but this one's pretty lightweight compared to my Louis Vuitton, my Luminous, my Speedy Bandolier 25 or 30 this is the most lightweight later handbag that I owned so I really love it and now it's the summertime so I always carry this handbag with me all the time and it still stays shy and beautiful so I hope this video helps you and please let me know if you have any questions and I will see you guys at my next video bye